Everybody put your hand up who has seen those five minute crafts on Instagram or Facebook. Now everyone put your hand down because I know everyone has seen them. So today we have decided that we are going to test three of these five minute crafts. So the first one we are doing is crayon uh, candles. So we have these like mason jar looking things. Hold on. Um, two packs of crayons. And for the wick, we're just gonna use some strip. strip. For that one, you'll also need a pair of scissors. Yes. <laughs> so for the second one, we are going to do a iPhone slash um, electronic device charger. So what you'll need is a battery pack. We just got ours from the dollar store. It just has a battery, it's a power bank, and we got a cup from McDonald's. And uh, we'll do that one. And the last one is going to be a makeup brush washboard. So we'll get right into it. We're gonna start with the crayons because we think those are gonna be the hardest. Wait a second, where's the timer? Oh, Sierra has a timer. We're actually going to test if these are test. actually five minutes because we think they're either gonna be longer or shorter. Yeah, we believe that our predictions, this one's gonna take 20 minutes. I think this one's gonna take probably six or seven minutes. And this one, like maybe two. two. Two to four. So we're gonna see, because it said five minute crafts. And I mean, they're very little, literal. Okay, so put all this stuff aside. Okay, let's open this. Okay. We're gonna start the timer now. Okay, so the items that it says you will need are a heating up device, <laughs> two of uh, any kind of glass containers, some string, and some crayons. So I'm, we're gonna do I'm gonna do a couple different colors. So we're gonna move kind of fast because in the I'm gonna do purple. So I'm gonna take three different color purple crayons because I feel like we're gonna need a lot. And in the video, they are open it, you want one? You're gonna do your own though, are you? Yeah. Okay. I can't even get it open. Oh, you know what? Scratch that. Oh man. Okay. I got a five second penalty. I am going to, let me see what I'm I'm gonna make it like a rainbow. What is it? Uh, yellow. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. Red. Okay, this one's already a fail because we're at four minutes and 17 seconds. But we're gonna see how long it actually takes. It actually turns out really cool. Uh, had I known, I probably would have used like triple the amount of crayons. But then you can probably, you know what? It's good because we don't use these crayons. Like they're, they've just been sitting here for a long time. Years probably. So, and a box of crayons is only a dollar. But oh, that's that one. 32 minutes it took me to make this. Next. Okay. okay. So it is the next day. Yesterday the power went out didn't come back on in time so we are in a new location and we are going to now do the uh, camouflage battery pack charger fun thing here we go oh, do it. timer oh yes we need the timer the five minute timer <coughs> I don't know why I went to calculator. Here's the calculator 
so cool. Okay. I'll open this. I actually don't know how to do it. I'm gonna keep this dragon. And yeah. So again, we got this from the dollar store. It is a USB mobile and tablet battery pack. I think it has 180 hours of standby time. The results may vary. It charges your device on the go. Oh, this has two cups. Oh. See, I must have washed it. This is perfect for that video. Okay, so we're changing up. We didn't realize that there was two cups. We're gonna go with a smaller cup. Okay, let me show them. Because you're gonna not gonna. So what you're gonna do is, if you have a cup that's see here, you just take it, and we're going to trace around the USB port. You're gonna be like, no, like that. I guess you can just do it right there. Doesn't matter where you do it. So now we're going to take this knife that we could only find and we're going to attempt to cut this out as neat as possible. Turns out because we have a opening. I think it's going to be easier if we use scissors for this part and maybe I can use this for this part. Always get an adult to help you if you can't use scissors. Two minutes. Two minutes. It would be definitely better if you had a little exacto knife or a blade of some kind. If you have a cord, where's the charger so you can show them when it's done. So I don't have a cutting board, but I do have a coaster that I'm just going to uh, lay rest on the table so that I can just slice. This one's not going to come out as easily. So that it's easier just to make one hole instead of the two smaller holes, then just do it like that. So, oh, sorry. Do we have to, we have to have to do that on or no? So then, like, everything that's not in the hole just like this. Now we're just gonna take some hot glue. Again, make sure, oh gosh, make sure you have a, an adult with you if you cannot use a glue gun, and make sure you stay away from all of the openings. Do not want a hot glue clogging up your uh, your ports. We are just about finished. Where's your port? Here. Okay. So now we just give that a couple seconds to harden. Hot glue dries really quick, so that's perfect for these kind of uh, fun projects. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get that in there. Um, oh, oh, my bad. Wow, well, this is part of the five minute thing, right? I can't get this in there. Oh, yeah, okay.
So this one actually is a five minute crap. So now we can take our cord and plug it in. Shoot. And there we go. Sorry about the brightness, but it is charging. And you can put that anywhere you'd like and have a, uh, you can put it in your car, in your car cup holder. If you have an older car that doesn't have a USB charger, or you can just have it sitting on your table. And you can also put a hole in the bottom if you'd like and have that plugged into the wall and have this just sitting on your table so that your cord's not all bent. Anyways, that one is a go. Now on to the last one. Okay, so for our last one, we are using a small cutting board. This was the smallest one that our dollar store had. Now we're gonna start, restart the timer. Now, this is going to be, we think, less, less than. Ooh. So, again, doesn't matter which side you use. You could got even smaller, but this is the smallest size they have. Do it this way. So you can, yes, you can have something to hold on to. So what they're saying is, even though this glue is kind of yellow, but anyways, it'll show up better. So what they did is they kind of just did cool designs. Ah. The hot glue gun's really hot. <laughs> so it's a little melty. This is like so tough. So, sorry, uh, okay. So I am now finished. So we completed this in- So if you can see, hold on a second, let me just see. I don't know, if, oh, there we go. You can see that I just did some, see, oh, here we go. So I just did some, a swirl, some straight lines, some dots, just a bunch of different textures. There's no real rules, but I kind of tried to do them a little bit thicker. So if you have a smaller glue gun with the thinner sticks, just maybe go over a couple times and then you'll get some uh, thicker lines. So we did this in a total of 
three minutes, 15 seconds. Now come with us into the washroom and see if this five minute craft actually works. So we're going to apologize now for the horrible lighting. Just pick one. This one's dirty. Okay, so here is a brush. This brush is used for powder. powder. So we're just going to clean it like we would usually clean our brushes. Just put a little bit of that soap on there. So we have put a little bit of our, oh, Sierra's makeup. We have to get a little bit wet. Uh, makeup solution on there or whatever it is. She's gotten it a little bit wet. I guess I should keep that on her. And here we go. Let me go to the other side. Oh, wow. Maybe it's a little bit more water. So there you have it. That five minute craft only took about three minutes and it works like a charm. That's all we have for you guys today. Those are three crafts, three five minute crafts. We had one that was totally off, one that was perfect, and one that was a little bit under. So I think all in all, it was very successful. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you next time.